it's amazing. I mean, for me, growing up in London, the Leicester Square premiere is always like the most exciting one because you kind of always see everything and everyone pop out. So yeah, it's cool. I'm really happy to kind of celebrate and see the whole gang again. And you know, I'm loving it. Well, Mia's kind of, uh, she's the one that just gets away with a lot of things. She's, um, she's naughty. She kind of doesn't have a filter really. She grew up in a great home. She was adopted for her. Her whole intake is just kind of like going with the flow, she's got money, she's just like, you're coming out and doesn't really acknowledge anyone else's problems. <laughs> For sure, I mean that was always expected because, you know, if you read the books you see how my character and I think the story in general really kind of transcends throughout the three trilogies. So, you know, in the third one I get kidnapped and it's, it was exciting, so it's going to be cool. I think what you can expect from Fifty Shades Darker is that it's just so sensual and intimate, you know, and everybody has such a great, fair, you know, role and it's gorgeous to watch and the colours are great and the music is great, so yeah.